Welcome back to Nature Goes Mark Indian Expedition, where we explore the science of plants with medical properties that are less known in Western countries. In the past episode, we introduced noni and its use in medicine, and today we will look deeper onto the effectiveness of noni as an anti-tumoral agent. The noni, or Morinda citrifolia from its Latin name, it has been used in Southeast Asia as an anti-cancer compound for a very long time. Modern science is only recently catching up. Today, I will summarize for you all the latest scientific research carried out on cancer. Noni has multiple cancer protective properties. It reduces EGF, the epidermal growth factor, which is often mutagenic in cancers and helps tumor cells proliferate. It reduces DNA damage, known as in fact rich in flavonoids, which stimulate DNA repair. It reduces the effects of reactive oxygen species or free radicals. Noni is in fact rich of antioxidants like vitamin A, which increases DNA repairing activity. It's anti-angiogenic. It prevents cancers from creating a net of blood vessels in order to be able to get more nourishment, expand, and then go into metastasis. It has cancer cell selective cytotoxic activity, meaning that it can inhibit tumor growth and progression into metastasis without affecting healthy cells. Fermented noni oxidate was injected intraperitoneally in tumor-bearing mice, which resulted in a significant increase in the percentage of immune cells like granulocytes and natural killers or NK cells in blood and the spleen. It was observed complete tumor rejection in normal mice, partial tumor rejection in mice lacking functional immune system cells like lymphocytes, and no tumor rejection in NK deficient mice, meaning that the fermented noni exudate is able to stimulate the innate immune system and the adaptive immune system to reject tumor cells. NK cells are the major player involved with the innate immune system. They responded quickly to fermented noni exudate and seem to be the major target involved with the anti-tumoral activity of noni. The noni precipitate works synergistically with chemotherapeutic drugs like cisplatin and vincristin, adding beneficial effects, but not with immune suppressive drugs like cyclophosphamides. This has been shown by an experiment which tested the noni precipitate from noni fruit juice and tested it against sarcoma tumor. The results showed 25 to 45 percent tumor reduction in mice, which was completely abolished when given in conjunction with macrophages inhibitors like chloradenosines or T-cells inhibitors like cyclosporins and NK-cells inhibitors like anti gm one antibody. To summarize, the noni fruit powder showed significant effects in the treatment and prevention of esophageal cancer in mice. Noni juice induced apoptosis in breast tumor cells, both either by itself during the initial stages or in combination with doxorubicin in mice. Noni is also commonly used by women with breast cancers all around India. Isolates from the roots of noni, which is mostly composed of kinones, have pro-apoptotic effects on colorectal and colon type of cancers. The growth arrest was shown to be carried out by an increase in caspase activity. Noni effects were comparable to that of chemotherapeutic drug cisplatin to induce apoptosis via mitochondrial pathways to cervical cancers, and again this was due to an increase in caspase activity. The noni juice is a non-genotoxic substance classified as safe by toxicology tests. It has been commercialized since 1990 worldwide and in 2003 the EU Commission approved it as a novel food. You can now find it in your local health food store as a food supplement. If you enjoyed this video, please support us by subscribing to our channel, sharing or liking this video or following Nature & Going Smart on any of your favorite social media platforms. Thank you!